Hi Skin Games judges, this is Stephanie Butler and I am checking in for week five in the acne category. Uh, this week Meg did have a little bit of more purging on her cheeks, unfortunately, and a little bit on her forehead. Uh, we're about halfway through the case study. Sometimes that benzoyl peroxide is still working its way into the pore and pushing everything out, so that could be part of it. Um, also, we did find out through her blood work from her OBGYN that she has extremely high levels of cortisol. And as an acne specialist, I do know that that stress hormone can really trigger acne and affect the skin. So um, she knows that she has to reduce her stress, so we're trying our best in that department. Um, also, we did move forward with the peel again this week. I did two layers. The first layer was a 7.5% uh, TCA, 5% mandelic acid, and a 5% lactic acid. So the TCA, of course, is to break down the keratin in the skin, and also mandelic helps lighten any post-inflammatory hyperpigmentation and post-inflammatory erythema. Uh, the second layer was actually a 10% TCA. I did feel the need to move things along a little bit quicker this week. She was a little bit dehydrated, but I did a skin sensitivity test on her to begin with, and she did fine with that, so I felt comfortable moving forward. Um, so we did incorporate some high frequency this week as well to kill bacteria and oxygenate the pore. Also, I left her under the LED light therapy a little bit longer this week just because of those cystic lesions and I wanted to move things along a little bit quicker. So despite her unfortunate news from her doctor and a little bit more purging, we're moving right along and you know doing the best we can with what we're given. So we will check back in next week. Thank you.